Counseling Micro Skills, Inviting Embodiment with Sandra Collins and Gina Ko. Gina, when we last met, we talked about um, two different sets of feelings. So kind of the cluster around um, confident and motivated and energized by the work that you're doing. And then on the other side, the, the little bit wary, um, maybe a little bit fearful around the potential losses for um, time spent mm -hmm. with your kids or, you know, the pu push and pull in different directions. Providing transparency, overviewing. And um, I'm wondering as you kind of reflect back on that, what comes up for you today? Questioning. I think the heaviness, when we talk about that heaviness that's um, carrying a lot, I, I would say on my shoulders, even that like I'm like rolling my shoulders back, I'm trying to do that more throughout my day because I, again, sitting so much have caused kind of quite a bit of shoulder pain on my left side. Um, As you um, sit and experience that tension in your shoulders, what kind of emotions go along with that? It's the heaviness. What else goes along with that sense of tension in your shoulders? Inviting embodiment. Uh, I'm thinking about knots, you know, knots that need to be kind of, um, what's the, what's the word? Un, unknotted <laughs> or, or, or I feel like I need to go for a massage. I don't know if that there's a, I just, I need, I feel, I need it to kind of come down. When I see you kind of bringing your shoulders down. Offering immediacy. Um, a bit of relief from the pressure, perhaps. Reflecting, feeling. Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. And then I know that um, exercise, you know, helps me feel that sense of relief. I know I've I, I mentioned naps, right, is crucial for me. Um, and, and, and connecting, you know, we're, we're relational beings, right? Connecting with a peer, or again, with my children, with my spouse and friends and taking time, you know, for example, the weekends, I, I try to protect that time, right? So then uh, it feels like that balance can is there and sometimes, you know, can be there when I uh, am intentional, right? And in um, relieving my body of all that sitting. And, that and what else happens in your body, either when you're sitting and holding that tension or when you are able to release it? Inviting embodiment. I think when I'm, if it's too much, if it's too heavy, uh, well, actually headaches. I, would, I have had headaches develop, you know, when it's, it's a bit too much. Um, I have had tummy aches as well, and my, my sleep isn't as great, right? When I am cognizant and intentional in living a more balanced life, um, I feel oh, even more, more flexible because I, I, I more in, in, in more um, intentional and in stretching in the mornings and right, going for walks or uh, exercising more. So, and then I have a stand up desk now actually where. I forgot I had it, Sasha, I believe it or not. So last month, my friend goes, oh, Gina, you have a stand-up desk. Oh, oh my gosh, I do. So now I'm using it more. And it's, you know, standing up straight and working really helps me um, yeah, relieve that, all that tension. Mm -hmm. So here we are meeting over Zoom, sitting <laughs> in our chairs. Providing transparency. What do you notice now in this moment as we talk about these things, as you kind of do a body scan and inviting embodiment? Mm -hmm. Well, these sessions definitely help me feel lighter. These sessions help me feel uh, a sense of relief and, and validation. And it, 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 it also gives me feedback that I am on the right path. Everything I've chosen to do in the last few years are important to me, important to others. So yeah, when we're we're sitting here, actually, Sandra, now that you asked me, um, my my shoulder doesn't hurt. Like I don't feel that heaviness in the sessions. Mm -hmm. So there's something about the the um, 
the talking about these things and the in the relational context that is shifting what's happening in your body reflecting feeling mm-hmm, mm-hmm. 